Meanwhile, Texas Attorney General Ken Paxton is suing Austin and Travis County for their decision to continue requiring mask wearing in public. Christian Flores has the story. We're trying to stay true to the science and the, and the data and the doctors. Once again, Austin and Travis County are in the state's crosshairs after Texas Attorney General Ken Paxton sued them for not rescinding their face mask requirement, which he argues is a violation of Governor Abbott's executive order. But Austin Mayor Steve Adler believes their order, which comes from the health authority, is not only legal, but necessary. Do you think your order actually has legal standing as it stands right now? It's not in my order that has standing. It's, it's the health authority these rules uh, that by ordinance are, are enforceable. Uh, and, I, and I think that follows directly from state law that says that uh, health authority rules uh, can be enforceable to protect the, the public health. We really can't control how people around us politicize things. Houston and Dallas require masks in city and county buildings, which is legal under Abbott's order. San Antonio only requires businesses to post their individual mask policies. Back in June, Governor Abbott allowed health authorities to mandate masks despite the state not requiring them, leading to cities like Austin and San Antonio establishing local orders. We're going to try to save as many lives as we can. We do that by wearing masks, uh, and, and we're going to continue to, to fight for that uh, for as long as we can.